but still, Badger. Oh yes! Oh yes! Right lads, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Caldonio Calcio. Now, if you haven't been following me on Twitter, you haven't been following my community's page, I have been tweeting and saying about resigning as manager of Caldonio. Now, the whole idea of this save was to build a club from scratch. We put fantastic youth facilities in place. We've had numerous bids for our youngsters. Some we couldn't control because they were only on youth contracts and we couldn't get rid of them. Some that we've now got signed Proto, we can now reject. Now, I've managed to get De Guidi on side. He's, if he hasn't signed yet, he's about to sign a new contract. He will be signing that. He will be signing that. The only problem is, we've, like, well, no, we did get decent money for him, but we don't need money. Andrea Antonelli, our best youth prospect. He'd actually played a couple of games for us. They've shoved him in the under-23s. I'd given him five appearances. At the age of 16, I thought that was pretty good going from me. Um, he was signing a pro... He, he provisionally signed a pro contract, so we didn't have to sell him. We could reject it. I rejected bids, 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 bids. And then the board suddenly decided to accept a bid for him. He has got a lot of clauses. I think we got something like five million up front and then all these, all these as well. Um... There was no need to sell him because money-wise, we've got 80 million in the bank. We've made 10 million pounds this season. We're making money every single month. So it was no need to sell him whatsoever. And it's kind of really... I'm, it's This series has kind of been around Baggio and its own town club. I have decided the, the voting, I had over 100 votes on, the, on my community's page. So thank you. 80% said resign. So that's what we're going to do. I've had no one say really stay... Bearing in mind, Baggio, as a person, if things are not done right, he quickly quit, quit as technical director in the Italian Football Federation because things weren't done right. He moves from clubs for footballing reasons. So, to give this save a little twist, what I'm going to do is I'm going to resign today and we're going to turn it into... Now, I did a journeyman last time and I didn't really like sort of like country hopping. And as Baggio is very much a... During his playing career, never, never moved away from Italy... I'm thinking I keep this in Italy. So, we're going to resign today. We're going to pick up a club. We have had sort of like, not the Juventus and the Milans, but we've had the Sampdorias, Fiorentinas, Lazios. have all been offering me interviews over the last sort of like couple of seasons. So, I think you'll be able to find a job. I don't know who's available. I don't know what's available. We might have to go Serie B. We might not even find a job today. But, that's my thought process. I'm hoping at some point in the save, we can come back to Caldonio come back hopefully the managers learnt the lesson it'll be interesting to see how well they do so since the last episode which was the Milan draw we've been a bit stuttery we have had a to be fair a difficult run apart from these last two games we haven't played well I managed to get in Lapadula as well I've got him in I signed him uh, so I'm a bit gutted to let him go to be honest oh if you notice I'm having skin problems my skin that I've used from sort of like the start, and loads of people ask me about. I must have found a bug. I was altering fixtures in my last uh, last episode, not last episode, last um, video that I've just recorded. And since I've done taken some of them off, it's absolutely killed it. So I've just gone back to the old bog standard, bog standard one today. If you know a decent skin, drop it in the comments below. Let me know where the download link is, and I'll go and have a look. Um, I am a bit particular about my skins as well. <clears throat> But any thoughts, let me know in the comments. Right, let's... So we are leaving Caldonio in 8th position. What a job. Four seasons in, three promotions. I've left them, started in Serie D with no players. Three and a half seasons time. We are 8th in Serie A. Really, really good job. That one there is standing out to me. I don't know if they've just replaced their manager or not. I don't know if they've got a manager. Um... That one there is looking something I'd like to get involved with. Right, let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you for everyone who voted as well. Oh, end of the season. No, I'm going immediately. 
Done. Done. Gone. Baggio steps down. Look at the look at George Jesus. Look four to one. The quality. Look how far we've got him. Look how far we've got him. He's pretty good as well, isn't he? Right. So we are gonna we're gonna keep it in Italy. I don't even know if I've got. I don't actually think I've got any other leagues loaded anyway. At any countries. There's Baggio. But have a look at the old jobs, aren't we? Not much. Nothing else in Syria. D's, 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 D's. Right, we could be um, we could be out of a job for a while here. Right, guys, I'm going to speed on for a bit. I'll come back in when something's changed, something's happened. Right, so Spile Manager's just been sacked. For me, it's not one that I really want. The rock bottom. Did like Spal ever since um, Doctor Benji's series a couple of years ago? That was probably my favourite Doctor Benji series. Um, I think they're on the way down, though, aren't they? Yeah. Calgary's job's insecure. Fiorentina's is insecure as well, I believe. That would be interesting one because I started so badly with that one, Paolo Sosa at Fiorentina. So we'll see. <laughs> right, welcome back. Not got a job yet, so it's been well, it's been uh, sort of like nearly four weeks, but. They've just promoted my under, what would he have been, under 20s manager. Decent at youth level, but look at that. Serie A, they had Jorge Jesus. Jesus, or whatever he was called, was one of the favourites, and they've gone for him. So you might see them slip down the table. I always want... What, what are you like, guys? When you leave a club like I've left it, I always want them to fucking sink. I always want them to sink. I always wanted to sink. So we're in 11th of February. Nothing really in terms of jobs yet. A few very insecure. I'm going to take off City of D. I'll consider City of C. Just because there's some big clubs down there. It could be Juventus, boys, you know. Oh, there's Palermo as well. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Roma. See, the idea, what I'm thinking is that I'll move around. So, like, so many awesome clubs, isn't there? Serie A. If we just go to Serie A, Palermo, Sampdoria, Fiorentina, Parma, Atalanta, I'd like to do. Udinese, Roma, obviously Napoli, Lazio, Inter, Milan, and Juventus. So, there's a lot in there. And not even going into Serie B, Sassuolo. Obviously, they're going to end up getting promoted. In Syria C, Brescia. So there's one. But anyway, let's let's get on with it. Let's carry on. Hopefully, we'll be able to find something before the end of this episode, or a job interview or something. <gasps> Palermo. What are we thinking? Best club of the year? What is that? What is that? Never heard of that one before. Hmm. I'm going for that. I am going for it. Palermo, obviously everyone knows at the moment they have been booted out of City of B and now basically bankrupt time to start getting City of D. I'll get the kits. Story, I'll get the kits. They've got Espirito Santo as favourite. Why wouldn't I be? Because obviously I've got Baggio as um, I've got Baggio as a decent reputation. Interact international football, blah, blah, blah. Right, I've applied for it. So we'll see. There are only three points off safety, so it could, it could be done. It could be done. Right, Fiorentina manager sacked. Now, I've already been Fiorentina. So I'm going to stay away. I'm going to stay away because in the first sort of like journeyman thing that I did with Baggio, I was Fiorentina and I got sacked. You should have a problem, but let me just change that. Just thinking, not going back there just yet. Palermo have now gone bottom. Get me appointed before it's too late. Here we go. 
Job interview. Palermo. Let's go. Let's go! Going to be honest, Roberto Baggio not trying to just get the job. Decent that the finances are secure, though. That's not something that you would necessarily um, associate with Pal uh, Palermo. Yeah. You are looking to make the step up from your previous club. Can you handle that? Football is football. I'll just deal with the media just dying. Thank you. Better, yeah. Yeah, I'm extremely confident of changing that round. Oli Gunnar Solskjaer was a previous manager. Brian Camden. He's a strong motivator and leader. We'd like to know when you intend to establish yourself as club's manager. Get me in. Get me in. Happy to work with a guy. No. Sign young players. I like that. I like that. It's only a little bit. That's all right. I thought they'd be more used to be dead up to the eyeballs, aren't they? But that's not too bad. Six six million the kitty. Obviously, we're not going to be in February, so we're not going to be able to get anything in anyway. So there we go. There we go. We will wait and. Atalanta is insecure but I do fancy this Palermo before everyone else plays it in FM20 <laughs> oh yes here we go we're in we're in boys we are in just going to accept it just going to accept it because it's pointless isn't it so here we are we are taking over as Palermo manager starting Away to Milan in two days' time. We are shit in hell. We've miles off the pace now. Right, so we've got a bit of work to do. What's the form like? Oh no. That's a friendly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven defeats on the spin. Oh no. Inter, Lazio, Foggia. Udinese, Calgary, Genoa, Bologna. We've got three away games coming up. Shit. I'm thinking my 3-4-3. Three, three. I'm thinking my 3-4-3. Three, three. Let's have a look at the squad. Alright, because we got one, two, three, four. We've got five keepers, so it's a good start. Obviously, there's going to be some shite in here. Top earner, Shaw. Oh, I've seen him. I've seen him. He's not too shabby. Box to box. Embalo. Winger. We've not got that many. Oh, we have. We've got plenty of defenders. Who's scoring the goals? If there is any goals scored. <laughs> oh, well, the leading goal scorer is uh, someone who's got seven, but he's uh, he's away on loan anyway. Six. Nestrosvik. He's not he's not bad actually, is he? He's not bad. He'll be an handful. Oh Lafasso. La yeah. Yeah. He's gonna have to play out of position. I can maybe play up front. Finishing nine. Brilliant. So, um, I think we're going to get relegated, aren't we? I think we're going to get relegated. What's the finances like? Fifteen in the bank, which is good. Six million. Slight loss of this year. How much money have they actually spent? Did they spend much? Eight million. Okay. But this guy coming in. He's already at the club. He's coming in permanently. Rousseau. Awful. Absolutely awful. 
Oh shit. I'm alone. 93 grand a month, so that's that's not going to be an issue at all to us, is it? So, guys, that is it. Let me know what you think of the new club, Palermo. First game will be the Juventus game. Uh, sorry, the Inter Milan game. Oh, my God. In two days' time. I've got a lot of work to do in those two days' time. Um, thank you very much for watching. We'll probably do a double. We'll probably do a double episode next week. We'll get a double episode in Inter and Lazio. Thank you very much for watching. This, as I said, this series is carrying on. It's now going to be called Baggio, the Italian journeyman. We'll see you next week. Cheers, guys. Thanks for watching.